This program contains scenes of violence, extremely coarse language, and mature subject matter. Some adults may be offended. Viewer discretion is strongly advised. Yeah. Do I look like I'm 15? No. Gotcha, bitch! So that's what I want to talk to you about. Do you want to talk to me about it? No. You don't? So you want me just to give it to the cops? No. So, I mean, if we don't talk about it, I have to let the cops know. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Because this is a big issue. And I got my phone like this just so you can't say I, I took no money or nothing like that. You yeah. know what I'm saying? This is just for safety. Okay. I'm not going to ask. No, it's fine. Okay, so why did you invite this kid? I messed up. Gotcha, you know, bitch. I messed up. You messed up? Mm hmm Do you have any mental issues? Uh, I'm a slight on autism. Autism? Mm-hmm. Do you take medication for mm -hmm. it? Okay. Are you scared or nervous right now? A little bit nervous. Okay. Why are you nervous? Uh... I'm, I'm not going I'm not going to hit you or nothing. Yeah, like no, that. I'm not nervous cuz of that. Just the situation. Oh, okay. So you cuz you know this is a, a bad thing, yeah. Mm -hmm. So autism. Like do you go to in uh, special programs or anything? Yeah. W what kind of programs? Uh I go to my specialist, psychological. Oh. So you do have some issues. Yeah. So, and how old are you? 33. 33. Have you ever done anything like this before? No. No? So why did you go through with it this time? I don't know. You ever talked to any other little kids before? No. If your dog come out, is it going to like jump all over me? Oh, no. Is it like a support animal? Yeah. If you want to get them, you can get them. No, it's fine. Okay, I just want you to be comfortable, bro, and not be scared. Yeah. Because I'm, I'm not here to hurt you. I'm here to make sure you don't do this again because this is a bad thing you know grown-ups should not be trying to meet kids and do sexual things with them yeah i agree you know so what do you talk to your therapist about <clears throat> uh just about like depression and so you have depression yeah from i mean it just happened or what, has something happened uh, in your life no yeah i was uh went through the trauma as a child like what, what happened? If you don't mind talking about it. Mm, kind of uncomfortable talking about it just because it's pretty big. No, oh, was it something like somebody abused you? Yeah. Um, well, I'm sorry to hear that that happened to you, bro. I really am. You know, but if the same thing is what I'm thinking happened to you, you know, I don't think you should be trying to do this. You know what I'm saying? Especially if you've been a victim of it. Yeah. 
So how do you think that kid would have felt if y'all would have went through with what y'all was talking about? Not good. Did you think about it? Did you think about that? No, uh, probably not. You didn't think about how the kid was gonna feel? I mean, did you think about yourself? Like how you felt when if somebody did it to you? Yeah. And you live here by yourself? Uh, with my dog. Oh, I mean, well, besides the dog. <laughs> yeah. Oh, man. Uh, and I don't do this kind of stuff, man, and try to mess up nobody's life or nothing like that. Like, do you work? Uh, yeah, I have a part-time. You have a part-time job? Did you grow up in Long Beach? Uh, no. No? Where no. are you from? I'm from Colorado, my parents. Oh. Still live there. Oh, so you came all the way out here by yourself? Yeah, because I went to, there was a call, psychologist that recommended me over here. Damn. So are they paying for your this apartment or something? No. So you got to take care of this mm -hmm. on your own. What is that loud noise? Oh, the TV. Is that another room? Yeah. Oh, I, that's not no studio? No. Oh, wow. Um. So just so you know that I'm not like some random crazy dude on the street. Your last name, right? Mm-hmm. Okay, so, and you didn't tell that kid that, right? Mm-hmm. I just hate that you had to try to talk with that kid like that. And what kind of makes me a little worried is because it seemed like you was kind of trying to be safe. Like you was asking him, like, what did he want to do? Why would you ask him what he wanted to do? Uh... I, I I usually ask when I have sex relationships because I want to have someone that's comfortable, just with anybody. Oh, that's comfortable. Yeah, just to make sure we're comfortable. Okay, so have you met anybody else off that app? Uh, I think like three people. Three people, and they all were grown ups. And shit. Yeah. You sure. Yeah. <laughs> Has anybody else that you chatted with on there ever said that they was underage? No. So Anthony was the first one. Mm -hmm. Stop the cap. Wow. So when he told you, how old did he tell you he was? 19. Uh, I think that's what his profile say. Because when I looked at his message, he said he wasn't 19, that he was actually something else. Mm -hmm. You don't know what he said? No. So, okay, if you don't know what he said, or if you thought it was 19, then why would you be scared or worried? Because he's young. Right. But how young is he? 19. Yeah. Yeah. 19? That's not against the law. Do you know what the age of consent is? 18. Exactly. Gotcha, bitch! So if he's 19, how can you get in trouble for that? Huh? Do you, do you for real not remember how old he said? It's reverse profile said 19. Okay, but when y'all was text messaging with each other, what did he tell you? Did he tell you he was 10? No. 12? No. So you know what he didn't say. So that's leading me to believe that you know what he said. Boy, just saw his profile that said 19. Ah! I know, I'm not talking about his profile. Look, I'm here to help you in a way. And try to get you to try to concentrate. I know you're nervous. And you're nervous because you know... You know what I'm saying? That you done fucked up now. You know that, don't you? know what he told you. But see, I'm, I'm trying to get you to learn how to be honest also. You know, I could have been outside yelling... And letting your neighbors know what you're doing. I mean, you want you don't want me to do that, right? You don't want them knowing what you're doing, right? Or do you not care? No. You good, bro? You finna pass out or something? You want me to call the paramedics? No, I'm good. You sure? You starting mm -hmm. to sweat? No, I'm good. Okay, bro. Like, you know, because you invited me here, so... I'm just trying to get you to be honest about this whole situation and you can be accountable about this and move on from it. 
But how can you move on when you continuing to lie? So I'm just trying to we trying to I'm trying to start elementary with you, bro. I ain't asking you what all sexual stuff y'all said. I'm asking you how old did he tell you he was? Cause you keep talking about his profile. I'm asking about when y'all was texting each other. Man, you scared me, bro. Like, I'm gonna have to call the paramedics for you because you sweating like a motherfucker. No, I'm good. I'm Ambulam! Where the Ambulam? Why the man body still the right man there? Ain't supposed to be lying Call the damn Ambulam! You no, know, you're not. You need some medication or something, bro. No, I'm good. I'm just nervous. I, I get that. Why are you so nervous? I'm not gonna do nothing to you. You said you wanted to talk about it. I think it's your phone. Oh, my phone? Oh, what well, I mean, cuz? Oh, my phone? Oh, what well, I mean, cuz, bro? Like, I don't want you to say, like, when I leave, I don't want you to call somebody and be like, oh, man, this dude came here. He fucking beat me up. You know, say you pass out or something. Okay, so look, just relax and chill out. Act like I'm Anthony. How about that? <laughs> <laughs> And it get hot, I got a lot of, I got hairy legs. Cause what was you and Anthony gonna do? Well, I just hang out. You know, hang out? What y'all gonna watch? watch TV and stuff? Yeah. What y'all was gonna be watching? A show. The one I have on. Oh, what you watching? Uh, I think it's called. Hmm? What was it called? It's not no porno or nothing. Is no. It? <laughs> 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 I'm trying to get you to laugh, bro. You know what I'm saying? I know this is a serious, nervous situation. You know, I'm not holding you against your will or none of that. You can kick me out of this motherfucker anytime you feel like it. You can be like, you know what, bro? I'm, I don't want to talk no more. I just want you to leave. And I'll get up and leave. Yeah, I think. Hmm? I think that's... Could we do that? Yeah. We can do that, bro. Yeah, I'm sorry. I mean, I'm, I hope you are sorry. I hope you will never try to meet another minor sexually again. No. You finna cry now, bro? Mm -hmm. Look, I'm gonna have to call the paramedics for you, bro, because you is tripping. You sweating like a motherfucker. I'm not gonna think I have my sweater on. Hmm. Out. What's going on? Yeah, somebody using my picture. So somebody using your picture? Yes. And you came to the same spot that they told you to come to? That don't make no sense. No, I came to buy milk. Why you come back out? Why did you come back out? I came to buy milk. You came back out because of what? So you saw me right there, no. and you changed your mind. No. Yeah. I came to buy milk. Why did you come back outside? No. Yeah, you just oh. said it was your picture. No. Somebody's using my picture. So somebody using your picture.